All right, these three rhythms will be a challenge because with all of those down strokes taken out, it gets very, very easy to drift those up strokes into the upcoming downbeat. So definitely focus on that accuracy. Really make sure you're tapping that foot on those downbeats. Uh, counting along all downbeat numbers is very helpful on stuff like this. This way you don't get lost. So what I typically do is I say quietly the downbeat number I'm not playing on to help me keep track of what beat I'm playing on. <clears throat> so here we go with number one at 60. One, two, three, four. drift start to happen, because it's going to happen, it happens with everybody, when you notice that start to happen, tell yourself to start hitting those upstrokes earlier than you think you need to. It does help a lot of people get the strumming pattern uh, in the more appropriate place. Alright, 60 bass minute for number two. <clears throat> One, two, three, four. final eighth note power chord strumming rhythm we're going to do because then we're going to start doing single note picking stuff which is going to tie in perfectly with working to mute these things so we're, we're going to be getting the focusing on that very soon here <clears throat> all right 60 beats per minute number three one two three four Feel that having the eighth note subdivision clicking along helps you, definitely use it. 120, one, two, three, four. Two weeks, that's right, you're gonna send a video because you're out of town. So in two weeks, throughout these two weeks, just start brushing up on those three note per string, or not three note per string, those three string, three note chords. Just keep them fresh. Uh, you can run through those chord progressions as well. This way you're not just running up and down. Um, so yeah, just refresh the chords we've done so far and just keep working the scale stuff best you can and 
or focus on the accuracy with this stuff. Be much, much, um, I can't talk. All right, I'm just going to stop talking now because I'm going to sound like more of an idiot. I'll see you in two weeks.